I'm Anil Kumar sharing with you NFT's present value example. The question here is, Aditi took a loan of $100,000 at 5.2% per annum compounded monthly. Find her monthly installment to repay the loan in 10 years. So the loan taken is the present value and we need to find the monthly installment. So we can use the present value formula which is given here. So present value is the regular payments 1 minus 1 plus i to the power of minus n divided by i. Now let's figure out what is i for us. We know that the present value given to us is 100,000. i should be since the rate of interest is 5.2 percent it will be 5.2 divided by 100 to convert to decimals and then monthly means 1200 so write 1200 so that is the interest we can calculate using the calculator 5.2 divided by 1200 that is equals to in decimals um, okay it's not a very good number to work with 4 3 recurring okay so that's the interest rate and now we have n as 10 years monthly payments so n is going to be 10 times 12 which is 120 correct knowing all this we can always calculate r so let's apply the formula present value is equal to r times 1 minus 1 plus i to the power of minus n divided by i. So present value is 100,000. So it is 100,000 equals to r we need to figure out. 1 minus 1 plus i is 0 0.0043 recurring. n is 120. So minus 120 divided by uh, 0 0.0043 recurring okay so uh, let's calculate this value it'd be easier uh, and then we'll divide that 100,000 by that value right so we can write this as 100,000 equals to r times what so we'll calculate this value so within uh, brackets let's put two brackets since we have to divide by this number also or okay uh, let's put one bracket one minus this is one point right so I'll write this as uh, 1.004 let me take three threes okay bracket close to the power of I mean this should come inside that is to the power of minus 120 minus 120 okay and then bracket close and then we'll divide by 0 0.004333 so that gives us uh, r times 93.41968 whatever so r is equals to 100,000 divided by this value which is 93.41968 so, so we'll do 100 1 2 3 divided by our answer which is equal to 1070 point four four right so so that is one way of doing it of course and uh, so we get your value of r so every month aditi should be paying 1000 seventy dollars forty four cents to repay this loan uh, in ten years so that is what it is as an exercise you can also find the interest she pays on this loan so that also could be done so we we will calculate this also let's try to play uh, find interest paid so interest will be uh, the amount paid so 120 installments so you total amount paid in a way will be 1070.44 times 120 right these are the number of installments 
so it is 1070.44 times 12 I mean 120 which is equals to 128 452.80 so that is the amount paid right so this is the amount paid let me write separately so so the interest will be difference of these two that is 128 452.80 take away 100,000 right so 100,000 so it's just 28 452.80 so that's the amount 28,500 approximately is the interest paid right so you can write down your answer that the regular payment will be dollar 1070.44 and the interest will be dollar 28 452.80 so we just extended this question to also calculate interest okay so that is why well uh, the another way which is better I think is just write r equals to rearrange the formula right so we'll just rearrange the formula multiply and divide to get your result so you could do that also i'm anil kumar and i hope that helps thank you and all the best